This is Anne. Like many teachers, she had only one computer in her classroom. But now, Anne is using Windows Multipoint Server 2011. With Windows Multipoint Server 2011, Anne still has only one computer in her classroom, but now that one computer is powering multiple user stations, each with its own monitor, keyboard and mouse. All her students will get a personal computing session just by attaching individual stations to the host computer. And because Windows Multipoint Server 2011 is specifically designed for non-technical users, it's easy for her to set up and use. When Anne turns on the computer, the system automatically detects the hardware she's added. She creates user accounts for each student. It doesn't matter which station her students log into, because everyone's session is running from one computer. Everyone will get a Windows experience, with features such as the familiar Windows desktop. And everyone can use programs such as Internet Explorer, Windows Media Player, and more. This student can work on his book report, while another student is researching Wales for her science project. With Windows Multipoint Server 2011, a single computer can run multiple stations. It's almost like giving each person his or her own computer. But it's more affordable and offers users the benefits of the latest Windows features. It's lunchtime. This student wants to join his classmates at recess, but he's researching his project on the web and he's in the middle of editing photos. So he uses the disconnect feature instead of logging off. That way, he doesn't lose his computer session. Anne can even disconnect a station remotely if the student forgets to do it himself. Windows Multipoint Server 2011 allows users to save files to both private and public document libraries. This is very helpful to Anne when she assigns work. Right now, she's assigning a quiz. To share the quiz file, she simply saves it to the class's public folder now everyone can have instant access to the file. When the student comes back from recess, he can sit down at any station and get right back to what he was doing, just the way he left it. Then when he's done, he can save his documents in his personal folder. While her students are working, Anne can log in as administrator and use Multipoint Manager to get visibility and control over what is happening in her classroom. Under the Desktops tab, she can monitor activity on workstations by double-clicking on an individual student's desktop and zooming in to see if the student is on task or struggling. When Anne double-clicks again, she returns to the thumbnails view where she can choose to broadcast one student's work as an example for the entire class to see. Or she can block all stations with a customizable message that gets the attention of the entire class focused on her. It's time for the quiz. As each student finishes the quiz, he or she moves the completed quiz into a personal folder in their private document library, so Anne can grade them later. As administrator, Anne is the only one who can use Windows Multipoint Server 2011 to access each user's private document library. Windows Multipoint Server 2011 supports programs like Microsoft OneNote that let groups of students work on the same project at the same time. When one makes a change on her station, it shows up on all the other students' stations almost instantly. Anne and her class have used Windows Multipoint Server 2011 as a learning tool throughout the entire day. But Anne's day isn't done yet. She still needs to grade the quizzes. She opens each of the students' personal folders and marks each student's results. She saves the graded quizzes back to each student's personal folder so that in the morning they'll be able to check their grades from any station. Windows Multipoint Server 2011, giving all students the 21st century skills they need. Just imagine what you could do.